As I was learning how to water ski, I was uh, always working in the restaurant business. So I'd ski during the daytime, and I'd worked in the restaurants in the evening. And so I got a lot of experience. And uh, so we try to keep our service at a, at a high level up here. And the food, of course, is we get a lot of compliments on it. Matter of fact, I, I, we've had over 100 people tell us we ought to have a cookbook on the food that we serve at the villa. So we're proud of that. If you're going to run a business or a villa, you have to have nothing but the best in your kitchen. So everything is everything's washed that comes in the kitchen. The eggs are washed, the tomatoes are washed, cantaloupes are washed. Everything's clean before it's served to our guests. So we keep a real high standard there. You have to, or we wouldn't be in business for 24 years. One of my favorite items is, of course, the Caesar salad. I've been making that for 35 years. Started in uh, Lake Tahoe when I worked at the Summit Restaurant at Harris Lake Tahoe. Waited on people like Frank Sinatra. The Caesar was first created in Tijuana, Mexico in 1924, and so uh, it was created at Caesar's Grill in Tijuana. My wife and I have gone there and experienced uh, making a Caesar to table side there, and, and it tasted a lot like mine, so I was very happy with that. Now uh, we, we have one dessert, uh, key lime pie, and of course that, that dessert is presented by our houseboy. We have to put on Kenny Chesney singing the key lime pie song, of course. And uh, we're, we're proud of our creme brulee also. Everybody yeah. thinks that Cinco de Mayo is the Mexican Independence Day. It's not. It is when we kick the French out of Mexico and we have the recipe for tonight's dessert. Nice. <laughs> You know, we, we try not to have you make too many decisions during the week. Some of your decisions might be, should I have dessert or should I take an extra ski ride? You're on vacation, so we don't want to put too much stress on you. 